Friends, as you can probably hear in my voice, I'm hoarse, lost my voice. Everything's great, I feel good. This video is a very short hunt. I get out in the evening and find some, a couple incredible things. I hope you enjoyed the video and God bless. Started. Sorry guys, <laughs> just got this right here. Looks like a dime. Uh, maybe not. Is it silver? Rang up pretty high. It looks like, I don't know what that is, a coin. It could be a penny, I guess. Since we got so many pennies. That looks like a dime. It's like a mercury. Mercury dime. Mm, I think that's what that is. It's a mercury dime. Yep, got a merc. <clears throat> okay, thank you, Lord. Well, here is the mercury dime. It is so toasted, I cannot get a date, but I can ID it as a mercury dime. <laughs> it is. Completely toasted. Man. Ninety four loud. There we go. Oh boy. Oh boy. This look looks like possible. Oh, that's a button. That's a button, dude. That is a button. That's a two-piece. Man. Oh my goodness. What do I have? Hmm. Oh, I think it's Georgia. Oh my goodness. Awesome. Thank you, Lord. Maybe something else. There's definitely something on it though. What do we have here, guys? Confederate officer's button. It is. It absolutely is. Thank you, Lord. Definitely. Group wing. So for a quick identification of this button, I'm going to reference this book, Record of American Uniform and Historical Buttons by Centennial Edition by Alpheus Albert. So I'm gonna reference page 357 from Albert's book here. And the button most like mine, or exactly like mine, is this one up here, number 22, which is CS22. And it has, this is the one with the line field border. Um, the left town has three arrows in it and the back is blank. It has an RV or relative value, rarity value, I should say, of 75 that 75 is a number between one and I believe 500 so one being the most common um, once you get above 50 really it's uh, those are very very rare buttons um, and for actual values I generally multiply by 10 so this would be, in general, I mean, there's a lot of variables that, that go into pricing up a button or you know selling a button, but um, $750 is generally what I, I would say it's worth. Anyway, so here is a picture of what this button, I mean, it looks like this actually, but I mean, 
all cleaned up, totally perfect shape. This is what it would look like. So you can see here in this button, the left talon has three arrows in it and it's a lined field with a border. The little stars are five pointed. They're all the same size, even the one on the bottom. The back is blank. As you can see, the shank is mostly missing. This is an awesome button. Very, very cool.